A new safety feature known as the Halo was implemented to enhance driver safety following Jules Bianchi's accident in the 2014 Japanese Grand Prix. A three-pronged titanium tubular structure called the Halo encircles a Formula One car's cockpit. During collisions, it serves as a shield to deflect or absorb impact forces. Designed to support a 20-kilogram wheel moving at 225 kilometers per hour, which is 15 times the static load of a Formula One car. Over the past few seasons, this has more than demonstrated its ability to save lives. From the incident involving Charles Leclerc at Spa in 2018, to Romain Grosjean's catastrophic crash in Bahrain in 2020, the car that overturned at Silverstone in 2021 belonging to Zhou Guan Yu. Carbon fiber is not the only material used in Halo. Rather, an aerospace-grade titanium alloy is used in its construction. Because of this, the titanium structure with three prongs, weighing only seven kilograms, can support the weight of two African elephants. The Halo is constructed from two tube sections that are welded together rather than one piece that is fully bent 180 degrees due to the tolerance needed between the rear mounts and the main structure of the halo. To be designated as FIA approved, each halo design must pass stringent safety testing as outlined by FIA rules. The only location in the world authorized to conduct crash tests on the halo is the Cranfield Impact Center. The FIA allowed teams to design aerodynamic fairings with a 20 mm margin of freedom to offset the aerodynamic losses of the halo, especially around the airbox. Teams cover the titanium structure in carbon fiber to fuse the carbon fiber fairings to the halo, providing the halo a cohesive appearance with the rest of the chassis.